Good evening everyone and welcome to the stream. Hope everyone is uh, doing fine. It's a Friday evening. So uh, yeah, the weekend uh, is uh, started. For some, it's already uh, Saturday morning. Like people from uh, in New Zealand. So today we fly with uh, Gulf Air. We fly from uh, Bahrain International Airport to Muscat in Oman. Now I needed to uh, change the uh, flight that I planned. So our destination was actually 19 minutes away from this airport. I don't know how I screwed up, but um, it is what it is. So I changed the the airport, actually the destination uh, this afternoon. So for the people that uh, didn't see it yet, um, yeah, there's a change of uh, destination. So we have already some uh, people in the chat. So uh, like and uh, Joe Trimpoli, hello everyone. Hope you are uh, well. So thank you uh, for jo uh, joining, uh, Joe. I hope you are doing fine. Also Eddie is here. Hello all. So welcome, welcome. Hope you are doing fine. And Carwin and Davis, uh, morning all from a uh, sunny Christchurch, uh, New Zealand, 21 degree. Well, that's a very nice temperature. Perfect for me. Night at night as well. So welcome to the stream, mate. Hope you are doing fine. And then uh, Karin, uh, I can night and night, uh, Joe, uh, Trimpoli and Eddie. I'm trying to see if uh, someone is uh, parked into me. I have a, a new plane, four engines, two tails, four wings. <laughs> nice. Okay. Um... Today we have a 1 hour and 40, uh, 2 a minute uh, flight. Um, there's another mess up that I saw. So, um, departure runway is uh, 3 zero right. And I made the plan uh, for actually departing on uh, 1 2 left, it seems. Um, yeah, we'll see what it will give. So, we need to depart at uh, 3 zero right. Maybe we need to uh, delete some waypoints for uh, to begin with. So once again, everyone, uh, welcome to this uh, last stream of the week, and um, hope you enjoy it. So uh, we start with a uh, GSX, and we can board the boarding uh, requested. Plane. There we go. We also will put on the webcam, but uh, be careful. Hello, everyone. Corin, I uh, hope your day went uh, well. Well, this morning was okay. While you were asleep. Well, it was fun. We had a, a stream in uh, at Brussels Airport. But uh, it was uh, a bit of foggy. Uh, it got even more foggy during the stream. I was not expecting that. So this is the Pewa Airport here in Bagrain. And then uh, we have also the nice livery from uh, Gulf Air. We have another one there. So uh, Joe is there and actually I need to check if he has the correct livery today because uh, I know what uh, livery he is uh, using. And it seems to be alright. So Joe, it's uh, showing the correct livery. Hmm. So now we know how to do it. Thank you uh, very much, uh, Joe, uh, for testing this out. Karin, I thought they only had uh, Dreamliners and Gulf Air only. Um, we will come to that um, once we are airborne. So. And then we will check out uh, what um, planes they have. So uh, we start with uh, external power, battery one, two, fuel pumps from one to six, and then uh, there's one, two, and three. And I hope everything uh, works. Exit uh, emergency lights armed. 
We can light on. Flight attendants, arm doors, and cross check. There we go. The notes are this. Don't forget that. The tablet, we uh, start that up as well. And uh, that guy is waiting here. Seems we don't board, uh, load or board. So, uh, FMC, we uh, click on that, that's good, then we go to the init page, and then uh, init request, my rest align, 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 <laughs> okay, confirm. Return so that is in already and the plumb wire everything goes automatically here in the Phoenix you need to fill it in by yourself some things and not everything. So we go uh, to the uh, second uh, page there we need to put the block fuel in. Block fuel uh, for today is uh, 9368. 9368. Oh. So it's just 9.4 is also okay. 9.4. There we go. And then we go uh, to the uh, flight plan. So OE departure. And uh, I think it's a 30 right that we depart. And yep, 30 right. And then we are uh, looking for the R. There it is. And why I put that in? All right. There we go. That uh, will be easier. We have uh, nothing to put in. So we'll uh, check if our flight plan is good. Maybe we need to uh, clear some uh, things, guys. Um, because, like I said, I was not paying attention when I was uh, making the flight plan uh, today. <laughs> So arrival is at two uh, six uh, right, two six uh, right. So that's uh, this one. So we have ILS today. There we go, and then uh, we go to Eligor one R. That's uh, this one. What else we need? So that we don't have that. And then we go uh, insert. And actually, I didn't test this plan as well. Very stupid. <laughs> All right. Uh, so flight plan. We will uh, uh, disk on right here. So let's uh, clear that uh, disk on. And then we see we have already uh, a little mess. Kratos. So I need to take uh, my plan with it. Because we uh, need to uh, solve this thing. Yes, 507. Where is that? Yes, uh, 507. Which are? So it gives me uh, totally uh, something uh, different. We go to Lovac. That's also there and, and one. I have this one as well. So BHR. I think we uh, can uh, delete a BHR. Clear. Alright. We'll clear the discount as well. 
Thanks, sir. Hello. Welcome to the stream, mate. Hope you are doing fine. Also, I made a, a complete a mess of uh, this uh, stream <laughs> already before it started. <laughs> so, excuse for that. So actually we go to MD 12 left MD 12 left, we will put that in Come on Dexter, and good evening if there is a revised uh, yeah, flight plan and uh, not to worry about uh, what should be uh, used for the uh, flight plan well the flight plan that I put in is the original uh, flight plan that uh, no that's the correct flight plan that we have uh, everything is good only I make a, uh, a mistake with the uh, runway so uh, no, we need to uh, depart on the runway at 30 right, but I made a flight plan for uh, 12 left, that's the opposite uh, side. So that's why my uh, whole uh, thing is uh, messed up. So actually we need to depart from here and going to there, but uh, now it we will do in this and then it mess up everything. It's a uh, flabba wire, so that's always a tricky thing. So 30 right, yes. But I don't understand a thing. Because FD or um, 30 right should be okay. No, we don't need that. So uh, if you are a dirty right, you need to clear if you that have that in your plan. And there we go. And then also will be a three and one. You also need to delete that one. Lovak, you need to delete as well. And uh, from Tosta, we will be a uh, good. Maybe uh, 1507, you need to delete that as well, I believe. Well, let's see. So, Roberto, do you want uh, warm drinks? No, no, I'm, uh, I need just uh, vitamins, that's what I need. So as we can see, uh, our flight plan uh, looks much better now. So until Lovak, um, well actually Lovak you can keep, but uh, everything uh, before that you need to uh, delete. No, Lovak as well. Lovak you need to delete as well. Uh, so we go from here, we make a turn and we go to direct uh, to uh, Tosta. Refueling truck is on so, its way. Um, yeah. Delete everything Please before a toss stop. Until the fuel truck and then uh, it should be fine. So we go to uh, 1507. We keep that. There we make a turn. And we go to Tosta. And then everything it should be fine. And then we uh, check our flight plan. And then we can uh, continue. Catering vehicles are on their way. So uh, the original airport where we needed to fly to um, in the month was actually uh, 19 minutes away from this airport. 
I'm not sure how I missed that. But uh, yeah, it is what it is. That was a pretty f uh, pretty short flight. So this uh, the rest of the flight uh, plan seems to be all right. Flight level uh, is um, three nine zero, I believe. Yep, yeah, three and nine and zero. <coughs> the super gamer, uh, can you wait for me? Where are we uh, gliding to? Or flying to? Well, everything is in, in the description. You find everything on Discord or in the title. <laughs> there, uh, we have the airport. But I cannot wait uh, too long. So if you want to see, if you want to fly, just make sure you are on time into the server and then we can uh, prep uh, everything on time. And especially uh, today. <laughs> So at uh, 39,000 uh, feet, that is our altitude uh, today. We put uh, and this on on both sides. We set the Q&H. Fuel truck is in position. Fuel truck is also there. Please don't load aircraft until the fuel truck arrives and ask to do it. And then we can also uh, we don't set the transponder uh, in this plane because um, we mess up our altitude and stuff. The Super Gamer, you find it in uh, here, right here, ohms. You find it in the title and also in Discord. There you find the destination code. Everything is there, mate. Carmen, uh, the glowing gaps is coming tomorrow to New Zealand. Oh, yeah. So uh, stay safe, mate. Hope you have no damage. Uh, you don't get hurt. And uh, everything. Uh, Hope everything will be fine, mate. It's actually a bit scary, you know. Right, you will know. Use your airplane fuel okay. so we need to set our uh, fuel so fuel uh, is uh, 9368 and 9 and 3 is 6 8 there we go and they are fueling that's a good thing payload uh, the passengers for today So one eight uh, five. One eight five. Cargo. I say a uh, one eight five. Hmm. That's not possible. And so uh, let's say just four thousand kilograms because we don't have uh, enough passengers. But what is uh, eleven passengers? Times uh, it yeah okay, four thousand. That's okay. And then we can uh, load the stuff, and it even don't take it. Let the night uh, push back uh, left or right. Um, we need to uh, push back to the tail to the right and tail to the right so we give it a bit uh, a little bit more uh, light as well here so that we uh, see something not at night okay no problem so we need to uh, go in there. So, Knight Knight is there. We else, who else we have? Uh, Joe there. So uh, Knight, um, 
Is that the correct livery that you have? But I don't have much liveries in my collection right now because I deleted my uh, community folder. But um, if you want to see the correct uh, liveries, um, we all need to send to each other or post in Discord uh, our livery that we use. So everyone need to uh, download those uh, liveries and then you will have the correct liveries in your uh, flight. So that's what I tried with um, Joe. So uh, Joe is showing up with the correct livery. So I don't know uh, the Kuwait uh, livery, if that is correct or not, but uh, I don't have much. I only have four liveries uh, for my fly-by-wire at the moment. We are flying uh, Saudi. Okay. So guys, uh, for the people that fly with me, and you want to see the correct livery on the stream or in your flight so make sure you have the same livery or I have the same livery in my community folder than you use so if you want to do that maybe I need to make something on um, discord um, where you can uh, link the livery or put the livery in so I can put it in my um, community folder and I can also give mine if you want or others can give theirs um, if you want the correct deliveries and for all the pilots Kevin uh, the Gulf Air Dreamliner is uh, taxiing yes so this is uh, FS uh, traffic actually that um, is engaged so this is a plane of uh, FS uh, traffic So, uh, very, very, so everything is uh, loaded up, so that's a good thing, um, and then we go back here, new, to the init page, second page, and then we click on it, and no, again, click, there we go, it calculates, then we go to the performance page, when it's done, right here, so flaps, um, one uh, slash up how many pilot pilots we have oh, first need to know that how many uh, pilots we have there we have a British uh, air race so we have a great at night Joe and a super gamer director are you flying yes you were flying yeah all right so one two three four five hmm. I will go to um, flaps too because we are also pretty heavy two sh uh, slash up and zero point uh, two there we go flex stamp um, 63 and then we have the uh, V speeds 121 122 why is it so low 126 oh yeah because we have uh, flaps too that's why dexter yes two and i think also the same aircraft model for the correct uh, plane which uh, might be a little harder on uh tv stream resources well maybe we will see we can try for the people that want to correct the uh, delivery uh send me deliveries that you use um if before the flight and not sh five minutes before the flight <laughs> Karin Davis uh, Kuwait Airlines uh, has two liveries and sizes uh, is a uh, 320 Neo and A330 okay nice nice thank you all right guys we are uh, pretty uh, much done here and I think we can start uh, EPAU there we go uh, so we need to put in the wind no wind I said there we go wind request there we go okay. 
All right. So I think we are pretty much done. Going uh, Manchester to Kuwait and back uh, six hours at least. Yeah. Manchester to Kuwait. Oh yeah, for sure. The super camera. Which way do we push back to the right? Tail right. Starbucks. No, I thought my uh, vitamins were coming, but uh, it seems not. <laughs> uh, keep on dreaming. Uh, I think we missed something, but we'll find that out after. All right, uh, we go right here. Services uh, door can uh, be closed. Shed bridge can be going or something, and then we can ask uh, actually uh, push back. GSX push back. Fair push back. There we go. Like uh, next uh, starting FU. All right. I will uh, prepare for push back. Joe uh, Drexel donated some uh, money in uh, some money for your vitamins. Yes, Drexel donated this morning uh, some uh, money uh, for my vitamins. So very, very, very nice, and thank you very much for the donation, mate. It's uh, very nice. Yeah, th this morning it was not uh, so warm. So I actually didn't drink any vitamins this morning at the. Uh, Hello, Captain. We're ready for pushback. At the airport, so. But um, yeah, at home I need. There is no problem. Uh, doesn't spend it all on uh, airports. <laughs> I do my best. But of course. Uh, it always helps me. Bypass pin inserted. Because all the things that I I do is uh, of course uh, not cheap. The the airports, planes, uh, the live streams on on, on the airport. It is it's, it is not for for free of course. Because I need to have the data the ser data services and stuff. You know, it's nothing is for free of course. Carwin, uh, check out my parcel and it's uh, in Sydney, Australia safely. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> so, uh, tail to the right. That's what I said. Locking gear. There you go. And there we see the Gulf Air taking off. It's actually uh, nicely done that it did take off. It, it looks nice. So they're raising uh, the, the airplane. Release parking brakes. And then they ask me to do uh, release parking brakes. We set first ignition. And why that uh, wind is not release parking brakes. Working. So are we ready, guys? I guess so. All right. Release parking brakes. Commencing push. All right. All engines clear. Start at will. All right, starting engine number two. <laughs> so next week, uh, Monday, we start with the Con uh, Condor uh, flight. So from uh, Frankfurt to uh, Palma de Mallorca. So uh, nice. Also, uh, thanks to Ignited Night, it, I believe, uh, for the um, planner, the flight planner, actually. Um, and I was actually um, wanted to ask you, the guy from uh, 
uh, a pilot's life to if there was a way to do that that i can use things uh, in 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 this uh, program that i have um because it will make my life way way easier but i didn't ask him yet and then suddenly there is it the just what i need engine and uh, number uh two is start we can start engine and uh, number one give everything a little bit light brakes. and then we set uh, the parking brake waiting your confirmation for good engine start and then we light up the panels a bit because at night a uh, cool feature uh it uh it opens up uh the sim brief and uh fills all the data yeah that's also a feature that he had in his um a pilot's life which connected with uh his sim brief you know um and if you have a plan you cl just click uh, export your sim brief everything is there it opens up you know it's those things are nice i'm a big fan um of this uh, product and I'm not sponsored by the way, but uh, I'm using that already a long time. So that's also where I get all my flights from. All the companies, all the flights that I do um, is coming from there. Of course, I, I use also a uh, flight radar to check the real flights because, uh, yeah, but uh, mainly I use um, a pilot's life uh, chapter two now before it was the uh, chapter one. Ground, Eddie had tree, one request taxi to the gate. <laughs> Eddie had tree, seven one taxi to gate one. Okay, so confirmation. Hot into ground. We have a good engine start. You can disconnect. Unlock the ignition here. can come off. Taxi to gate one eight using taxiway tango. Zulu Eddie had tree seven one. Eddie had tree seven one. And then we set our flaps to uh, ten to two. Hold position, Eddie had tree seven one. And we can also uh, turn off uh, APU bleed and uh, APU itself. And then we can uh, turn on taxi lights. And then we are good to go if uh, everything is clear. Truck disconnected. Bypass been removed. Left is clear. Right is clear. Joe, uh, I had a quick uh, look at it uh, yesterday and it looks good. Thanks uh, to Clint Knight. Yeah, it looks good. Just what I needed. You also see the idiot uh, livery. Also nice, a nice tail. And then we check uh, if everyone is ready, holding Matt is uh, and coming along. So we just uh, correct a livery. Okay, so we taxi to a runway uh, 30 right. Parking brake. Off. Is it off or not? I have no clue. I think it's off now. Okay, there we go. It's more responsive than the Phoenix. I don't know if it's realistic, but it's more uh, responsive because uh, the Phoenix don't respond so quickly. Oh, watch out, guys, uh, for that plane coming from the left. It will continue taxi. That's a wonderful job for uh, ATC. So the guys uh, crash into each other now with that uh, plane. <laughs> Oops, we need to go uh, to the left here. And 
then we need to take the uh, runway actually to go to um, 3-0 right Karin, how long is the flight today? 1 hour and 42 uh, minutes Joe, uh, that plane is not in my sim <laughs> No, I know So that's actually FS realistic that is engaged <laughs> And is working now So So for the people that are new to the sim, this is a must have this plane you need to and download this one this is a uh, freeware so make sure you download this if you are on the pc it's not on the xbox but on the pc make sure you have this one and this need to be your first plane you have also the 8v30 also a nice one so also for free children bully i drove uh, into the dirt uh, to avoid Nothing. <laughs> nice job. Are we all short here? Bahrain Tower Gulf Air one one two three ready for straight out departure at runway three zero right. Yeah, I was following this uh, without knowing where we're going actually, and if that was a correct uh, runway, but uh, it is. Runway three zero right Gulf Air one one two three. Okay, so I line up. But it does also a beautiful sound this uh, plane. <laughs> and then uh, we are waiting for the A380. That is coming from the same guys uh, from Flyby Wire. And so let's wait for that one. Should be uh, a nice plane as well. We saw already a video from the interior, and that's amazing. And uh, yeah, will it be for free or not? I have my doubts about it because uh, it looks so nice. <laughs> User uh, two three two. I'm help uh, Turkey. Uh, work is very busy these days. Yeah, I believe so. After the shock uh, or the earthquake. Dexter, okay. I'm not flying. Why not, mate? What's wrong? I'm at the wrong airport. No kidding. What airport are you? <clears throat> I think you are at the oh what? <laughs> I loaded the flight plan. Can you uh, see me? Uh, no, I don't see you, mate. No. I don't see a name tag. No. So at what uh, airport are you mate? I tried to uh, rest and I'm not sure how messed up, don't worry. 
Uh, yeah, but uh, let me know what airport you are. Are you at the airport that I planned uh, originally? Uh, because that's only 19 minutes away from this one. And I'm actually not sure in what direction, but it's uh, 19 minutes away from uh, this uh, place. So that's not far. So depending the extra weight yeah user uh, it has a profound uh, impact on the economy yeah indeed I'm at uh, OBB so you are on the correct uh, airport mate you are here with us you are here with us. So that's the correct and uh, airport, but I don't see you. The super gamer ready. The director, you need to be with us, mate. Why I don't see you? Ignore me, really tired. Um, I must be at the arrival airport. Oh. The arrival airport, so you are at uh, Ohms, so Muscat, are you there? Hmm, that's uh, a bummer. But if you were at the other, the original uh, destination, airport then you are only 90 minutes away maybe closer or further away I don't know check that out uh, which airport that you exactly are are you at uh, Ooms or that other one that I planned before yes Ooms. oh yeah that's uh, one hour and 15 minutes out so yeah okay uh, sorry to hear that okay that's a bummer mate that's a bummer well um then we fly together monday because uh, we fly from germany to palma de mallorca and i'm excited about that back later okay so guys uh tonight at night uh, did you take the screenshot Good night, uh, it will take uh, a few uh, minutes. Change the airport and choose a runway and no engage in the sim. But uh, can he uh, do his flight plan then? Because he need to uh, make the flight plan then in the sim first. Otherwise, otherwise he has no flight plan maybe. I have no clue actually how that works. <laughs> so today uh, we have uh, the Neo of uh, me, we have a Neo of uh, Ignite at Night. And uh, someone is engines are uh, not running. So we have uh, two uh, planes uh, on top of each other. So do we wait for uh, Dexter until he is on the uh, runway and then uh, he can fly with us. This, uh, no, don't wait. So uh, you loaded up the target airport earlier because uh, you wanted to check out the freeware airport uh, loaded uh, in the three eight, uh, three ten, but uh, then went off uh, to have dinner. Yeah, that's always uh, something. Next, I might try it, uh, to 
uh, try and start from uh, another airport. Okay. Kevin Davis, uh, got my drinks here, uh, sparkling, uh, duet, orange, and a lemon food drink. Okay. Nice. Enjoy. Okay, guys, there we go. Timer is set. already a long time so filthy afraid of climb gear up flaps one flaps retracting and we need to go to 39,000 and not 38,000 there we go So bye bye, um, by by grain. Bahrain approach Gulf Air one one two three is tight Airbus A twenty and two miles northwest of Bahrain, two thousand four hundred feet. So you have also some uh, scenery. Uh, that's paver scenery that you uh, see here. I forgot about it. Otherwise, I could uh, show you. And maybe this is also included. But uh, yeah, this is how it uh, looks. The super gamer you crashed, how you did that? So this is uh, our uh, view that we have uh, from the cabin. The super gamer you crashed, you are still on the same place, so is your sim crashing? Or uh, did you have a crash with your plane because you are still on the same uh, location? Uh, sorry guys, but I don't know what happened with a uh, YouTube. What happened with YouTube? <laughs> so we need to go to our climb mode. There we go. Take us is off. More standby, so we don't use that. Dexter, uh, YouTube seems uh, fine. Yeah, maybe there was a bit of uh, delay or I was not watching live, so maybe that was the thing. Coming now, uh, YouTube is fine on my end. Now it's okay. Alright. Nice, nice. Wonderful playing this one. I really like it. Also, the sound. If you go to the cockpit, the sound of it, it's, it sounds nice. And uh, we have no uh, Miss Lazy. And also, this is a, a free plane. The only thing that can a bit messed up sometimes is your uh, flight plan. That's the only thing. All the rest is uh, fine, guys. 13,000 feet already. Last can come off. Silver sign as well. Coming there, uh, they have the Dreamliner uh, 70 year special at uh, Manchester. Yep, yeah, so the 70 year anniversary. But this is the uh, A320 Neo then. And the Formula 1, uh, Girl of Air, Bagrain, uh, Grand Prix. Let me check out uh, our other uh, pilots. Oh, 
Oh, yes, uh, okay. I thought he was still at the airport. So, what about uh, Gulf Air? Um, so, that is uh, Gulf Air. Call sign is Gulf Air. Um, country uh, of origin is uh, Bahrain. They are founded on uh, March 24, 1950. So, base or main hub is Bahrain International. So, OB, where we just uh, started. The fleet size is uh, 33 aircraft and 4 on order uh, or planet. Every uh, fleet age is uh, 7.4 years old. And uh, official website is uh, golfair.com. We have also Facebook, uh, Twitter, and another page. <laughs> so they have the Airbus A320 at 200. They have uh, 11 planes of it. Uh, average age is 12.9 years old of that type. And also the Airbus A320neo, the six of them. They have also the Airbus A321, the 200, they have uh, four of them. And then the Airbus A321neo, they have uh, five of them. So uh, there's one coming into the future. And then the Boeing 787 Dreamliner 9 uh, series. They have uh, seven planes of it. And uh, there are three more coming. So that makes uh, 33 uh, planes in total and four that will come into the future or already are arrived. So that's a uh, goal of air. Karin, uh, I don't like a goal of air much more into Emirates, okay? The Super Gamer, my uh, autopilot isn't working. Um, yeah, I guess it will be the same problem as uh, last time. Then, um, Aviation with Elliot. Uh, hello, welcome to stream, mate. Hope you are doing fine. Been a while. Then, Cloud Tonight, uh, hello, and also Corin, hello to Elliot. The Super Gamer, do you have world updates? Uh, uh, yeah, uh, in two days, I believe. There is a world update for similar date. I don't remember. I think in two days we have it. Come on. What happened with my views? The Super Gamer, what free planes do you uh, recommend besides the flyby wire? Well, the Hatwind A330. I think that's uh, the only one. The A310 you already have as a freeware in your uh, sim. So you don't need to download that one because you have that already. Because it was a free gift of uh, a Microsoft. Um, and so the only other one is the flyby no the headwind a330 so that's what you can use i recommend those so we are at uh at our flight plan correctly so that's nice so we cross the sea here and then uh, we will go over land normally we should uh, fly over the sea but uh, I want to see some land or sand. Yeah, tonight I was approaching uh, too low. Oh, oh. Okay. Coming, uh, I wonder why that at night plane crashed yesterday uh, on the sand. So, yeah, it was approach approaching uh, too low. And then, uh, it, uh, 
uh, skiing next week. Oh, nice, nice, nice. You will ski. Don't break anything. And don't forget the Alpreski. Uh, the Super Gamer. Where do I get the checklist? Not at night. Uh, I was just uh, a little short from the runway at Corin. Yeah, it can happen. Thirty thousand feet already. So, we're climbing uh, at a fast rate after ten minutes. That's fast. Why that's so fast today? The super caver. What is the headwind called? Well, the headwind. The headwind is the Airbus A330 in 900 Neil. Corin, uh, hopefully it won't happen uh, happen again uh, at night. Well, we always hope that uh, everyone uh, lands safely. Alright, do I see uh, someone on a Valanta? Yes, I see. I see the guys on Valanta. And they are exactly on my route, so that is a good thing. But I'm actually not following uh, Valanta, why is that? Carvin, the cartoon uh, guy, uh, not here either. No, uh, today everything is uh, working nicely without him. That's nice. So it was a weird thing that cartoon guy, but uh, that was already an indication that something was wrong. Um, we only discovered that on our arrival airport. Elliot, uh, I will be uh, slow at uh, first, but uh, the checklist doesn't uh, take up much uh, time after you perform in it in a few time, a few times. Yeah. The super gamer, where do I get the headwind? Um, yeah, go to a flight uh, sim and to and put in headwind. Louise Roke subscribed to the channel. Louis, uh, welcome to the stream. Hope you are doing fine. Thanks for uh, joining and subscribing. So, thank you uh, very much, uh, Louis. Louis, sorry. Very nice to have uh, a subscriber on the stream. Very nice. Joe, uh, you are uh, a rocket today. <laughs> Hey, how is everything? Everything is fine, mate. The only thing that is not fine is my... Well, I'm sick. <laughs> so, uh, going this morning to the airport was not a good idea, I think. Because I got already a call from yesterday or the day before. But it was still okay, but uh, after I came home today, my eyes are tearing, my nose uh, was running during the stream I was uh, sneezing uh, in Belgian dialect so some people asked me if I could uh, sneeze in uh, English because otherwise they don't understand so yeah after I was sneezing in English I got uh, not aged uh, one bit <laughs> really a uh, coming one thousand nine hundred uh, seventy so so far. Well, actually, it was uh, a one point nine eight, but I kicked one because at at one thousand one thousand nine hundred and eighty, and I kicked one, so I have uh, seventy nine. 
so normally I should have now maybe someone else left 1980 with uh, Luis thank you very much uh, Luis Corinne uh, maybe after uh, a good rest uh, after the stream we might do the trick well the problem is that I need to work tomorrow <laughs> that is uh, <laughs> the big problem it's a very bad timing just before the weekend no, not good true lol Corinne uh, I've been sick uh, but drink water and heat healthy uh, and now better um, Karin, uh, don't say that, don't say that, uh, that you drink water and you feel better, don't say that please. Because some people are listening that will give me water, yeah, I don't like that. <laughs> Just say that you drink uh, Coca-Cola and that you felt much better. Just say that. <laughs> Uh, glad that night uh, that's a good excuse to stay at home this week and a new uh, cold uh, stream um, no um, of course it's it's an excuse or it is a thing to stay home but um, it's not possible to stay home my colleague is in uh, Tenerife fit so I need to go he asked me if we, if we could go to Tenerife um, so that we were sure that there was uh, someone there so he's uh, on vacation so there is no backup hey, uh, flying with uh, Vizair on uh, Sunday to Lyon Expiry, uh, what is that? And then with the A321, you think? Okay, nice. Have a nice flight, mate. Just yes, have the seventh good evening. All uh, would have enjoyed today, but apparently the sim had other plans. After a small uh, 30 megabyte update, um, all my profile settings, uh, flight hours, logs, and everything else is gone. Wow, I remember that XP72 had the same thing after an update I don't know which update but he had the same everything was gone so sorry to hear that uh, G77 um, thanks for joining anyway um, I hope you are doing fine but it's very sad to hear and uh, sometimes I'm scared to, to have that as well because then you can start over and it takes a lot of time Joe approaching land yep it's uh, nice to approach a land. We are also at approaching a uh, cruising altitude, 39,000 feet. That means something. Chutrim Volleyball, which is under seven, that's not good. No. Karen Davis, how I'll put uh, it uh, in this way is just eat healthy and drink uh, LMP. <laughs> Thank you, mate. Thank you. You're my hero. Hello uh, the Super Gamer sent them a boat, I assume uh, the bot probably uh, blocked uh, the link. Good night, uh, good evening. Shit, 77. So, yeah, 77 at the show, yeah, do not have uh, the time to set up uh, all again, it seems I. Uh, I'm not the only one, at least uh, lots of uh, pilot, uh, pilots uh, on the forum starting to complain. Let's see, maybe they uh, can restore uh, something. Yeah, I remember that uh, XP72 at the same, uh, yeah, also lost a lot of things. And uh, if you have that, it's uh, never a good thing. So, guys, I will give you a view right here and then I will uh, pick up some uh, vitamins uh, to restore my health so I will be back in one minute and uh, yeah grab something to uh, drink as well and uh, yeah, then we continue our flight so see you in one minute
So guys, I'm back. So welcome, I'm back to uh, the stream. And then uh, we check out uh, the pilots, so they are uh, right behind. Um, maybe I need to slow down a bit because um, I was uh, like a rocket, they said. So, but don't make the same mistake as yesterday. to uh, turn that off again I can go 220 there we go so we slow down a bit hello uh, does anyone here have the H145 yes I have um Super Gamer, what's the A330? That's uh, a plane, the Headwind A330, the Airbus A330. Because that, uh, I think we are flying over Iran now. Uh, again, that is uh, possible. I don't know where we are. <laughs> that is possible, but uh, there is not much uh, houses here. It's uh, all desert. Super Gamer. Uh, Difference from the A320, yeah, it's a different plane, a bigger one. Carwin, uh, David gone uh, when I was back tracking the stream, okay, but I'm back, I'm back. And then, uh, early out at the production, um, how do you update the uh, 145 from Operations Center? The, uh, this is our new uh, physics uh, update. Uh, I have no clue because uh, I removed. I did never did an update uh, because I have it not so long ago. Um, but I removed everything out my community folder, and for now it's not in. Or I just deleted my community, entire community folder uh, a few days ago. So yeah, it's not in. So I'm also not flying that uh, much. The Super Gamer, what plane is Aerosoft making? Yeah, the A330. Uh, Guys, cheers and uh, have a nice and uh, well, uh, wonderful hill. Also, enjoy your weekend. Very important. Relax. Jill Vilnov. Or check. Well enough. Ignited night. Uh, cheers. The super uh, gamer. What's the difference between the A330 and the A320? Well, the A320 is smaller than the A330. The A320 is a, uh, a small body, and the A330 is a wide body. The A330 flies uh, can fly more a uh, distance. Has more passengers. That's what it is. Cockpit uh, looks uh, uh, very similar. It's an Airbus. So, so not uh, push that uh, like button, guys. Uh, if you like the stream, thank you very much, Ignite and Night, as for your support as always. You have uh, 15 likes uh, so far, so thank you very much. So, uh, Joe is almost at a uh, cruising altitude, or is there? Karin, cheers, thank you very much, uh, cheers to you as well, mate. So for the people that want to see the cabin, 
well, in the way the cabin tour. Oh, door is locked. So that was the cabin tour. There is no cabin. <laughs> Come in, uh, there is a eight three thirty uh, similar to triple seven. Uh, Credit at night, the eight three eighty has uh, twenty two uh, landing wheels. That never count them. Oh, 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 I see Betsy Trotwood. There he is, but I can not see the number, so is he flying? Not yet, it seems. He's still on the ground, so he's waiting for us. We're still preparing, so Trickster is there, is coming. Nice, nice. Enjoy Tromboli at Tromboli at night tonight and not after I land it. So guys, uh, once again, uh, for the next stream, that's uh, next uh, Monday evening, that is the next uh, stream. So then we fly from uh, Frankfurt in Germany to uh, Lepa, and that's actually in Palma de Mallorca in Spain. We do that with a Condor Headwind A330. Very nice plane. It just received the update as well, so that's nice. Then uh, Tuesday, we go uh, to Mexico. And I will not uh, pronounce the names of the uh, places, but we fly with the Phoenix A320 and uh, Viva Aerobus. On Wednesday, we fly the 146-200 and we fly um, in Bolivia. So we stay in Bolivia as well, and we fly the 146200 uh, from Ecojet. And then uh, Thursday is the last uh, stream then uh, for that week, and then we fly from uh, Sydney uh, to uh, Cambridge in Tasmania. And we do that with the Phoenix A320, and uh, a name that uh, Carwin will not like, but we fly with uh, Jetstar. So that's all the flights for uh, next week. Of course, there is always that uh, something that can change, but uh, for now, that is the plan. Good night, uh, I can see Betsy, yes, we see Betsy as uh, preparing, so nice to see him and there. Oh yeah, the, you were on uh, the hard and lot and stuff, oh, don't sound good. Carvin, the Super Gamer, the A330 is similar to the 777, which carries more than the A320. Elliot, I think I did well on physics, uh, I did well on biology, I think uh, highest uh, or second highest in class, two uh, marks away from the highest mark within the three classes, nice. Elliot, uh, with the balls, uh, look back. Sorry, I cannot read anymore. Where is that much at again? Oh, you deleted or what? I don't know. Well, I cannot see good guys. Karina, I fly just star in September. Okay. Uh, 
the super gamer on Monday. I don't, no, don't worry. I just need to. You just read in the wrong order. Yeah, yeah. Because otherwise, uh, if I'm too late, I've also that on the chat in 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 say, on the airport. If there are a few landings after each other, I miss some uh, messages and then they are gone because uh, it scrolls up and then I don't find them back and I need to start to scroll. It's very uh, difficult to do that with the laptop and I have no mouse, you know, and then, uh, yeah, in the meantime, I'm losing more time and more messages. So I always start from the, from the bottom, but sometimes I don't get what they are meaning because I miss some messages. And today my eyes are very bad, so... Elliot, uh, you found out how to update the 145, it's uh, so cool. Alright, nice. Uh, Joe, uh, to the extra, which uh, waypoint are you heading to? And Elliot had a uh, one for five. Is probably my favorite add-on uh, for the sim. Well, it flies a bit too easy, I believe. I compare to the other ones that I have. The other ones, uh, other ones here, yeah, I cannot fly, or um, it's so hard to fly. And uh, one for five is so easy. The extra BMB. Hi. Hey, uh, you can uh, turn off out of frame. Yeah, I know. I know. The extra, yes, uh, I took off uh, from. Uh, okay. okay, that one. I think that's uh, supposed uh, to be ill like that. Yeah, I know there are a lot of options. It's, it's a nice, it's a nice uh, aircraft, but yeah, but I've not uh, spent enough time in it. I did a stream in it, um, or just showcasing the the helicopter once, I believe. But um, I'm not a specialist, and as you know, I've uh, not enough time to discover everything, and to fly everything, and then spend time out of the streams on the flight simulator so today I will be also need to rush because my flight plan was uh, I yeah messed it up I made a, a flight of 19 minutes I don't know where I got that but uh, 19 minutes is a bit short so I need to redo uh, or find another airport make the flight plan and also all my flights for next week because nothing was done I still need to um, make them uh, also take the screenshots and stuff and put everything online Elliot, uh, I enjoy small airfields up uh, in it yeah that's what I like to do as well if I fly um, offline that's what I do and so we have indicated a speed of 220 so uh, 486 ground speed we have a crosswind of uh, 120 something like that Joe to the extra uh, looks like you might end up in front of us that night uh, you are so far mate well seems I need to reduce uh, even more I reduced already so uh, I reduce uh, even more so Mr. Um, Dexter also uh, don't uh, go too fast because I'm also reducing uh, my speed <laughs> Dexter uh, is too far ahead 
uh, fly a hold somewhere again. Yeah, because I also just reduced my speed again. So we're close to the minimums. Joe, uh, guys, and I, at least uh, he won't fly through uh, you today. <laughs> The Super Gamer, um, hi. Okay, have a nice weekend. <coughs> so for the yeah, sim com the sim actually there are not so many um, news. So across the lands, uh, westbound airport and briefing materials uh, released. Yeah, and then uh, military simulation announced UK carrier strike group. That's it. Of the rest, I don't have any uh, news. So we see uh, Batsy, he will fly a uh, hold. He's at uh, 23,000 uh, feet. So, yeah. And we are flying for 38 minutes. We can go to the progress page. We can put in our destination airport. Our destination airport is uh, OMS. So, O O M S. And we put that uh, right here. <sighs> Sorry. And then we see that we have a 263 uh, nautical miles to go to our destination. Now, if uh, it's uh, pretty much in a straight line or not, no, we need to go to the back, to the other side of the airport to uh, land there. Okay, so it's even a bit further. So it calculates actually in a straight line to the airport, so this is uh, not correct. But we fly the experimental version of the fly-by-wire, so top of this end will be a mark, so we have a VNAV. Um, so that is uh, no, very nice. You can also go here and then calculate uh, the top of descent. Uh, let's see, it is uh, zero just make it uh, easy and that is a uh, 122 then that we have and I thought we had a full house uh, and the plane is actually pretty light we have also pretty much uh, a lot of fuel oh and we have zero packs why we have zero packs that's why my plane is so uh, I forgot my Passengers, we can have the same symptoms as uh, Joe. That's why we are so light. That's why I'm uh, like a rocket today. I filled in 174 passengers, clicked on this button. We had 2,000, almost 3,000 uh, kilograms of uh, cargo. And now everything is gone. All right. So that's why we are so fast. Dexter hold at uh, Helme. Okay. Next, I think uh, there might be some uh, vitamins uh, for me in the fridge. Hick, hick. <laughs> Enjoy them, mate. Enjoy. Cheers. Joe, uh, don't worry, I have your packs today. <laughs> yeah, I found already that we were so fast climbing. Um, that everything went so fast. Also, departure, uh, takeoff was so fast. You know, and then... Yeah, now I see that my packs are missing. 
I filled it in. I'm sure of that. So what, uh, Dexter, what kind of uh, vitamins will they uh, use today? So today we had a, a stream at the airport and uh, Monday I was also there but didn't stream because it was impossible to stream um, because of the fog but uh, today there was also a little bit uh, of, of fog and then uh, suddenly instead of going it away it uh, got worse. So. Thanks for a butt for me. <laughs> uh, okay, but that's uh, always nice. But Cowan, uh, 114 likes uh, for the airport uh, in total. Oh, um, I didn't check it anymore, but I know that I just over the 100 and yeah, 102 when I finished, I believe. Joe, um, with World Productions, uh, do is any of you, your beer uh, comes to Australia? Um, I have no clue. From your brewery? Um, no, I don't think so. To Australia? No. Because we have... Um, other breweries as well um, all over the world so for Australia it go, will go from there uh, maybe maybe yeah it's possible that there's some beers maybe the Stella Artois uh, I don't know but uh, we exported to um, the US but we don't do that anymore now but uh, yeah, before we were exporting to the US, so it's possible that we still do it for um, Australia as well, but I'm not 100% sure. I know we uh, do it for um, Italy and stuff, so whole Europe. But Australia, I have uh, actually no clue. So Joy, did you ever see, um, probably you will, uh, Stella Artois or something, or Lava? Joe, can you send uh, me uh, some uh, names via Discord of your peers and I will check it out. Uh, yes, I can do that. So... But I don't know all the names because there are um, brands actually that we don't uh, make uh, in our brewery in, in where I am, but in some other uh, breweries. So I don't know all the, the beers, just uh, the best one I know. <laughs> but the ones that we uh, and do or make uh, at our brewery, brewery then uh, I will uh, send them to you. Those are the lesson that you are the most uh, famous, actually. But we have also um, Corona. You probably know that Corona. We have also uh, Cubanisto.
Oh yeah, I and mean, I forgot uh, one other, um, and that's a Budweiser. So since uh, one or two years we have a uh, Budweiser as well. So uh, we make a uh, Budweiser here in Belgium before it was made in the US. Now we make it here in Belgium. So Joe, you know Corona? Yeah, Corona, Cabalisto, that's also from our company. Yeah, the night uh, Budweiser is an American uh, beer, but it tastes uh, very light compared to other brands. Yeah, it's a it's a lighter beer. It tastes very light. Um, a friend of me, uh, he lives in Italy. He likes Budweiser uh, a lot. So, and uh, yeah, it's not bad. It's not a bad beer. Going Davis, uh, we have Corona Heineken. <sighs> Heineken, what's that? Uh, Carlsberg and stuff in New Zealand. Never. Corona is a uh, Mexican. Uh, you had a lemon to it, right? Good uh, night. Um, actually, I never um, drink um, uh, Corona. No, it makes you sick. <laughs> it's a virus. No. Uh, no, to be, uh, to be honest, I don't uh, drink uh, Corona. Um, I've actually never tried it, I believe. But maybe I will do it uh, one time, so I don't know how it tastes. I have no clue. Come in, all beers. So, but probably, I think in Australia we will also find uh, Stella Artois. I believe you can find it there as well. So, uh, in the meantime, Knight at Night is with us. And uh, then Joe also don't need to be, uh, will be not that far, I mean. So we let... Uh, There was quite a night, his engines were not running, it seems, they, they were a bit blocked, his uh, fan blades were white. <laughs> Excuse me guys. to uh, drag to a setva okay where is uh, setva oh setva all oh, right that's not that speed reduced to 220 okay i'm also at 220 i believe yeah, no, 210. That's uh, my speed. I'm uh, reduced it uh, to 210. <coughs> so, our top of descent, uh, it says uh, 68 nautical miles away uh, from the airport. That's pretty late. 
this after a uh, soda so between the soda and the uh, illegal thanks are back again sorry I had uh, a bit of uh, trouble all oh, right cut that uh, 200 now okay <coughs> Next, did you had some problems with opening your uh, vitamins, <laughs> or with the flight? So, but oh, there is Betsy. We are already past you, or what? Oh, okay. Sure. I can't find the bottle opener. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, Joe Trimboli, you have a good memory. Low, uh, low ideal as Guapo. It makes more sense now after your previous uh, stream. So low eye is actually uh, it means that the uh, that you are not beautiful. So he is not low eye. So I have always uh, someone else is a low eye. So mostly that's me, or just chicken nugget. And so if you ask him who is Guapo, then he will say, I am. So. But Dale, yes, uh, today there was a, a guy from the UK and uh, his last name was uh, Dale and that's uh, exactly the same name as the first name of my son, Dale. Coming uh, usually when I open my uh, fizzle, uh, fizzy bottle, I do, I, I do it quietly as it uh, makes a pop sound and my flatmate and gets worried that I drink oh okay mm, yeah but I think uh, if you drink a beer that is not a problem as long as you don't drink um, too much every day that is not a problem but uh, sometimes you need to enjoy just a bottle of beer or a glass of beer you know Especially in the, in the summer. If you uh, if you are uh, have a good time with friends or so, then you uh, yeah I can recommend it to drink a beer. But never fly and drink at the same time. Always drink before you fly. Ben, uh, welcome to the stream, mate. Hope you are doing fine. And a uh, uh, happy weekend. <laughs> so for the most people, uh, it's a uh, relaxation now. This weekend. And for me, it will be a hard weekend. <laughs> because uh, if I'm sick, then uh, I don't function very well. And uh, it's very tiring. Okay, now they left her. Um, welcome to the stream. I hope I pronounced that uh, good. So, hello, uh, where are you flying uh, this flight? Uh, the flight will continue after a long time. Which airline? So, we are flying from uh, Bagrain uh, International Airport to Muscat in Oman. We do that with a Gulf Air in the Flyerwire A320 and Neo. Currently, we are the located, uh, I don't know where, somewhere uh, in the desert. And uh, we are flying or cruising at uh, 39,000 uh, feet, and then uh, we meet uh, right at night here again. <laughs> and we are flying for 56 minutes. Um, expected uh, flight time is uh, 1 hour and 42 minutes. 
it will be a little bit longer because we are flying uh, at a low speed so that's uh, a little bit uh, of the flight today so uh, Jeanadi uh, Leffler uh, if I pronounce that correctly uh, if not my excuse so so you have a little bit of uh, the information of the flight hey you see metal man uh, hey mate and everyone how are you doing today um, I'm late in the stream no problem mate better late than never <laughs> that is uh, always the thing um, but yeah welcome to the stream we are uh, flying for 55 minutes at the moment and uh, we are flying to Muscat in Oman with the fly by wire A320 NEO so cruising altitude is at uh, 39,000 feet Joe a director ooh a chain around your neck I always know where the bottle opener is director oh nice Thanks, what is your uh, next waypoint uh, PEDEX uh, for you? I will check uh, for you, mate. The next waypoint is... SEVDA. S-E-V-D-A. Uh, actually, I can show you on my thing, then you can see what I mean. So, uh, SEVDA, this one. That's our next uh, waypoint. Joe, yeah, says well for, for you. There's the same. You're subcompact. Hello, hello. Welcome to the stream, mate. Hope you are doing fine and thank you for joining. So, uh, happy weekend for you as well. Karin, uh, strange to see, is not on my stream, on every YouTube stream. Yeah. Dexter, uh, redirecting uh, to Zelda. All right. Good night, Atlanta. Showing our a uh, nice uh, formation. Uh, I will check it. Where are we? Okay. Nice, nice. So meantime we have uh, 19 likes so thank you very much uh, guys uh, for the like or the likes and also uh, Joe passed us so we wait uh, for a Betsy and then uh, once uh, Betsy is again with us or no we can speed up actually no Betsy Betsy, Betsy is there so once uh, Betsy is with us, then we can speed up again, and then uh, yeah, we're going towards our um, destination airport at uh, Oman, Muscat Airport, also Payware Airport. So that's uh, nice, and it looks uh, pretty nice, I believe. Your yes, subcompact, uh, I need to fly with you guys uh, sometime. I never got chance. Your yes, subcompact, I would be happy to see you flying with us really so if you ever have the chance and do it and uh yeah we will have a nice flight today uh Derek is flying with us cat at night is flying with us and uh joe himboli is uh, flying with us so sometimes we are with a uh, six today we are out with uh five Joe Chimboli, I can transfer your passengers uh, mid-air. <laughs> uh, yeah, you can try. Fly next to me and then uh, open your door. I will do the same. I don't think we need a chain saw or something because otherwise it's not uh, possible to open it. But uh, your subcompact, 
you're uh, welcome anytime and if you have the time then uh, fly with us so if you want a flight plan on time then uh, it's always on uh, discord i put every uh, before every flight as soon as possible uh, the flight plan also the map on, from navigator nav no little nav map and stuff i put everything uh, there and uh, if i didn't mess up it should be fine but today i messed up so we can always uh, find the details there And that uh, is the same for everyone else. If you want to fly with me, just make sure you are on time that we don't need to wait. Um, and then uh, every detail of the flight plan of the flight is in Discord. So join Discord and then go and uh, fly uh, with us. But for now we fly yeah like uh, next week at our the the biggest or the place like that we are flying today and even bigger but um there will also come uh, some other flights um yeah with other with smaller planes as well that will come and maybe also in the future with bigger planes <coughs> so i try to do everything a bit that also try to fly every company company in the world that's uh, my target so next week we don't have uh, the a310 so i'll try to put it in uh, for the week after depending on the companies of course and deliveries that are available. Good night, uh, incident uh, Ryanair, oh, yeah, Manchester to Lisbon, Boeing 737 800 turned back uh, over southwest England, uh, Squawk uh, 7700. General uh, emergency, and uh, just returned to Manchester with a medical emergency boy. Okay. All right. Thank you very much, Jack. Night at night. Thanks for the info. So I hope uh, the person on board is uh, will be okay. Yeah, I also get uh, those messages uh, from uh, Flight Radar 24, but there are a lot of uh, those emergency things. So, yeah. But this one is uh, a medical uh, emergency. So, serious. Good night, uh, US uh, fighter jets uh, have uh, shot down an unknown, unknown uh, object flying at uh, 40,000 feet over Alaska, oi, oi, uh, which uh, the US Department of uh, Defense has uh, posted a reasonable uh, threat uh, to the safety of uh, civilian flights. Yeah. Why Alaska? Hmm. Yep. Did you see on Microsoft Flight Simulator this uh, morning I did a flight uh, from Manchester to Tenerife on the Toya 737-800 my altitude was at uh, 41,000 feet oh, so it's a nice flight my colleague is in uh, Tenerife at uh, this moment well yeah no he's coming back today he came back today I think it was that or he left today, I don't know. Maybe. But it's not at work uh, this weekend. Yes, subcompact, uh, so uh, much aviation news recently. Yeah, and that's never a good thing. And 
that's not a good thing. Also, um, what was it? The 787 from, uh, help me guys. <laughs> that uh, departed from uh, Doha uh, to uh, Copenhagen from Kuwait is that Kuwait? yeah go from Qatar, Qatar early story um, uh, the tr uh, troubles uh, as well uh, started to lose uh, altitude went back to 800 feet had a descent of uh, more than 3,000 uh, feet a minute so something was wrong there as well so uh, yeah but that's also not good news after I could uh, go back to a cruising altitude and uh, landed safely but uh, I think it's not a good news there was a, a problem uh, with the plane so yeah terrifying Cowen uh, anyway I got her head off now uh, see you all uh, next uh, Tuesday morning my your time have a great weekend uh, Cowen you too mate uh, have a wonderful weekend uh, and thanks for your time here um, yeah and I'll see you uh, next week uh, Tuesday your time and the Monday evening my time so uh, I hope I'm better at that moment uh, I guess not because I will not have much rest so we will see then hopefully we see each other and next week on a stream from uh, Germany to Palmada Palmada Mallorca so have a wonderful weekend uh, Karin and uh, enjoy relax So good night uh, by Carwin, uh, director, have a good weekend uh, to Carwin Davis, so, yep. So in the meantime I will uh, check for my top of descent. It's there, right there. So it's for... Soda. Before sewed up. All right, that's good. That makes makes uh, more sense. Judging what I'm holding at uh, CD zero uh, nine. Okay. You subcompact, will you get the flyby wire AT80? Um, I'm not sure if it is for free or not, because everyone thinks it will be for free. Uh, but I'm not sure of it because it looks damn good, From especially the inside. So I don't know if it will be for free. But anyway, if it will be for free or not, I will get it. It's not my favorite plane. But um, it's just to uh, support uh, the people that work on it. That's one thing. And then also, yeah, a lot of people want to see the A380. Uh, it's not my favorite plane, but uh, yeah, I will get it. I think it's uh, one of the planes that we need to have. So I will get it. If it's payware or freeware, uh, it doesn't matter. I will get it. So I think uh, if you buy it, it then you also support the whole team and then you also support this plane because this plane they made for free. Actually the base is, is, is from a Sobo but uh, with all the updates that they did uh, it with the instruments, yeah it's a nice plane. As you see uh, tonight I'm doing a London Heathrow to Manchester um, on a BA. A320 271 Neo, then Manchester to Lisbon, then the top Portugal A320 
to fight for Neo, then Lisbon to Palma de Mallorca on uh, Jet 2, the 737 Max 8. Okay, nice, 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 nice. Have uh, wonderful flies, mate. Uh, good luck. Next, the A380 is really impressive, but uh, not for me, I think. Well, I think if it's for free, then you for sure you need to try it out. Um, it's maybe also not for me, but I will I will get it anyway. Um, freeware, payware, mm, I don't, uh, I'll not think about it. Uh, if I will buy it or not, I'm just buying it. That will be for sure. But it's also to support uh, the people because uh, they do an amazing job and for this plane there were so many updates so uh, and everything was for free and they built it from the ground up some other um, developers they just uh, converted from uh, FSX uh, or something and then uh, with those people and uh, make the plane from the ground up Michael, welcome to the stream. Hope you are doing fine. Thanks for joining. Join Dream Molly and you uh, like and you like you said, I will be uh, interesting if we all line up on the runway with the A380s. Well, yeah, maybe we can do that. But like I said, it's not my favorite plane. Um, also, the Antonov uh, 225 is not my favorite plane but it's coming to the simulator and uh, yeah i think uh, it will be nice to fly it once maybe not every week but uh sometimes it can be fun because now that it is free uh that is official really is that official that it's free mm -hmm. impressive impressive so then uh, i think we need to give uh, a coffee uh, to the people uh, from uh, the flabba wire team You see, uh, I just uh, got the Air New Zealand uh, British uh, Boeing 777-300 on the Microsoft uh, Flight Simulator. Oh. Yeah, that's the... Uh, what's the name of that plane? The developer, Captain Sim. You're so compact, I love anything Airbus. Other than the A310 and A340. Oh. Well, I don't like the A340. Um, it's an ugly plane. Uh, I can tell you that. That's uh, my opinion, of course. But I like the A310. I like the A300. So that are uh, the same planes, actually. But uh, yeah, I like those two. And Dexter is, is flying the A310 uh, today. Michael, the A340 is lovely. Well, yeah, like I said, it's a uh, personal, you know. Um, some people like it, some people don't like it. I like to see it because I don't see it that much. Um, and sometimes I like to see it but uh, the engines are too small and there are too many <laughs> there are four engines and it looks a bit odd but other than that yeah, it's, uh, it's okay as you see i love the a 18 100 oh that's a small plane but you also don't see that uh, much the a 18 uh, not uh, many companies that uh, use them anymore. In the meantime, we have uh, 22 likes, guys. Thank you very much. So a little bit more than uh, 40 nautical miles to go before we start our descent. I know Lufthansa is uh, still the A340s because I was looking for a flight to Asia. And I had an option to fly the A340 with a uh, Lufthansa. I decided not to do that. Uh, 
Hey to see uh, our friends and Tarot Master. Got them? Yeah, it's possible. But there are not so many. I don't see them uh, so often uh, or almost never. Because of the planes that I see uh, mostly at the Brussels airport. And uh, there we don't see them. So we don't see there at 8340 because the Air Belgium uh, don't use them anymore. So they, they had started with 8340s, but now not anymore. Um, the 8318 we also don't see. So we are uh, flying for one hour and 17 minutes. Michael or Michael, I don't know how to uh, pronounce it. Uh, if I do it wrong, my excuse. This Microsoft Flight Simulator has an A340. I think there is one in progress. Um, for now, we don't have that. But is there so? Is there one in progress? Help me out, guys. I'm not sure if there is uh, one in progress. It's possible. <coughs> In the sea, on Microsoft Flight Simulator, you can get uh, liveries on the planes. Uh, yes, of course. You can uh, almost uh, download download almost every livery that uh, there is. For the smaller companies, is a bit more tricky, but uh, yeah, the most liveries are there. So guys, uh, who knows that there is a, uh, for sure, the, the A340 is in progress. Something thinks about that in my head, but I'm not sure anymore. So there is a Betsy. Seems uh, we're catching up with him. So right behind me is Knight at night, and then and Joe is uh, a bit more to the left, and then the extra we see him there. You can see there is uh, one in progress, but I'm. Um, not getting it, uh, it's a uh, otherwise one. Okay. All right. So we need to enter a destination the data. So what weather we have? There we go. So temperature twenty degrees. The wind is right here, and the Q and H at ten seventeen. So we go to the performance page, and next page, and the next one. So ten seventeen. We put that in. Temperature 20 degrees it was, I believe. Wind, uh, it was 230 at 6 knots. 230 slash 0.6. There we go. And then we still need to borrow. Okay. As you see, I just uh, had that uh, oak uh, my coffee, uh, pretty tasty. You should try it. Maybe. open a coffee but I don't drink coffee that's something when I don't get into my mouth <laughs> there is a to uh, Michael uh, the 340 same here at first I didn't realize that is uh, the thing was a um, thing <laughs> all right okay and we go to Navigraph and I uh, ask for the chart. Ch 
chart chart okay open that please so we have ILS which one do we have we land at a runway twenty six right twenty six right So I, I believe uh, the borrow is at two two nine. Can someone can for com confirm that? So it is actually a two two nine or two three nine. We put in a two two nine for now. There we go. Michael uh, Sim uh, Smart is uh, making the A340X at the moment and not sure it will be pay rare. Uh, to, okay. Thanks for the information, mate. I really appreciate that. Always oh, nice to know uh, about uh, planes that are coming to the uh, simulator. It seems uh, and Dexter is already at the sending. We will uh, descend in seven, uh, eight, and nautical miles. So altitude is set to three thousand. I need to check it again. Where we need to be? Three thousand four, three thousand three. Yeah, should be okay. Next, uh, somehow I get uh, got ahead again. Only it's just so on Valenta. Yeah, I see that you are in front of me. You are descending, but uh, I'm also flying uh, pretty slow. I will speed up a bit. That was uh, in indicated two ten instead of two forty. Dexter, uh, Joe, to Dexter, do you have uh, packs? Well, I'm totally empty. Michael Avalonte has brought uh, some uh, for uh, tracking your uh, flights. Uh, yes. So we use that. We also can follow each other here. So that's uh, always uh, nice to have. Also, that uh, night is the sunny. Am I the only one that did? No, Joe. <laughs> Joe is at 41,000 feet. All right, Joe. Thank you. So yeah, Vlada is very nice uh, to see and to track everyone. It is see uh, cyclone is nearby here in New Zealand, mate. Uh, winds uh, gusting up uh, 120 to 170 km an hour. Heavy rain uh, as well as to 8 meters massive uh, storm. Yeah. Today, a few showers turning into heavy rain at night. Well, I just see uh, stay safe, mate. Uh, hopefully, it will be done very soon. So, I don't like those things. I think nobody. Oh, we need to start our descent. There we go. So guys, uh, we are descending. <laughs> Derek, uh, to Joe, uh, packs. Yes, I have passengers on board. Well, I don't have. I forgot. Actually, I put them in, but uh, something went 
wrong. Maybe I didn't open the door or so. <laughs> As you may have noticed, we have begun our initial descent down to our destination. Now would be a good time to wrap up any business here to take care of as we prepare for our approach. If you are up, once you return to your seat, we ask that you remain seated until the aircraft arrives safely at the gate. Flight attendants, please prepare the cabin for arrival. Okay, so that was the captain, that was me. <laughs> In the sea, uh, descent uh, to 28 uh, thousand uh, feet, mate. Well, well. Dexter, now, uh, no, <laughs> but I'm um, not familiar with the uh, packs uh, otherwise. Is that another one? No, I just think uh, is talking about um, the passengers, packs, we call that packs. But packs is also an add on that you can buy uh, and it loads up your plane like gsx um like a look air tool things like that it's a bit similar hey you see uh, where's the the airport mate well airport airport is on the other side here um uh, where it is yeah it's somewhere there so just next to the to the sea and i believe it yeah it's somewhere there and so oman muscat so that's our destination airport Joe, I think you made my mistake with uh, loading the passengers. I put the number and it shows them, but you need to uh, then click the double arrow to actually board them. Yeah, I did something wrong, I believe. Those. Oh, I clicked this one. That's what I did. So there was a number, and I actually I didn't check this. I uh, clicked, uh, put in this, and then click this, and I thought it was boring, and it was full with this. This was full. So yeah, probably uh, did something wrong. So that's why my plane was so fast today. It took off so fast. Everything went so fast. So we're flying for exactly one hour and 30 minutes. So we're very close to our arrival. Joe, uh, yes, it shows uh, full, but uh, that's just uh, a preview. Okay. Well, good to know. There are the things uh, if you don't fly uh, frequently with those planes, then uh, there are things that you can go wrong that you don't know anymore you forget or you just don't pay attention for it so yeah if you will fly this plane every day then you should know the extra transition altitude really high here at 13,000 feet okay so at the moment we are 20,600 uh, feet we are going to 7,000 feet and then uh, Yeah, finally we go to 3000. Bram, uh, evening everyone. So good evening, uh, Bram. And this is uh, my English uh, dialect. <laughs> Hope you are doing fine. And my, my dialect is actually not from um, Brussels. The other guy was, uh, is typical uh, Brussels uh, speaker but uh, my uh, accent is not from Brussels <laughs> we are talking about the stream from this morning
Here you see, you may uh, as well drop your landing gear now, mate. Uh, I don't think so. They're way too early. We are still at uh, 21,500 feet. Ram, yes, the other guy was very uh, much a uh, wrestler. Yeah, he is. Yes. I don't know exactly where he lives, but you can hear that. So, but he's a very nice guy. Uh, he's retired and comes there almost every day. And so he enjoy it. And it uh, also brings some rest to him, also to me, because uh, you can relax. So after the stream, I had uh, an, uh, yeah, a little chat with him. Mostly I do that. So that's a nice thing of uh, a plane spotting that you can uh, talk a bit. And we are not talking about planes. So just a uh, general talk. And there's director on my other side with the A310. Joe uh, to Bram. Hello, hello. Uh, oh, yes, uh, Bear. Hello. What's that? I saw that already today. Seventeen thousand uh, feet, guys. In the meantime, it's uh, eleven twenty-one, and I think uh, the flight uh, passed uh, pretty fast I thought it was would be a struggle because I was uh, sleeping actually before the stream started so we had some uh, dinner in a restaurant and uh, when we came home I directly went to my bed to rest a bit to get a better feeling before the stream Dexter, oh, I see mountains. Did not expect that. Uh, yeah. I'm not familiar with this location, so I didn't see a house yet or a street. Joe, uh, we have uh, we share alias B aircraft uh, tracking data with online services such as uh, Flight Radar 24. Oh, okay. Nice. As you see, it's uh, currently 11.21, the Saturday morning here in New Zealand. Alright, so there's a 12 hour difference. So, uh, the orange thing or yellow things that you see here that's about the uh, TCAS in this plane I don't uh, turn the TCAS on because sometimes we are flying very close to each other uh, we do that on purpose um, but then with this plane my plane starts to go down to avoid the other plane so and uh, we, we don't want that so that's why I uh, turn off the TCAS So I believe the airport needs to be there somewhere. I believe. We're at uh, 10,000 feet or almost, so time to turn on the lights. And there we go. And then also the uh, seatbelt sign. There we go. 
Joe at 922 uh, a.m. Uh, here with a pleasant uh, 22 degrees. Yeah, that's nice. We'll be getting up uh, to 33. Oh, no, 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 no. Just stop at uh, 22. That's perfect. To my station is not up as southwest uh, Sydney. All right. I have no clue what they are talking about. <laughs> We need to reduce speed, guys. All right, you're fine. Speed breaks off, and Betsy is in front of us. Ram, uh, oh, whoa, okay, and not even remotely monitoring in the same area. We need to drop speed again. What is going on here? Why the plane doesn't do what we need to do? Joe, uh, you make me love at Windbull's Productions. Why is that? <laughs> In some things I'm a noob, you know? Also in flying, but... Don't tell anyone. <laughs> one hour and uh, 39 minutes, so we are a bit later than uh, expected. So uh, normally it was uh, one hour and 42 minutes, but uh, we were slowing, uh, yeah, slow it down actually to catch up with everyone. So we turn 24 likes. Nice, nice, nice. So we need to make uh, one more turn. And that's uh, right here. That we uh, need to make the turn. Right there. Not here, but right here. And then we line up with a uh, runway. I think uh, Batsy is already uh, approaching there. Then I go to Sky Dolly. Where is Sky Dolly? And I will record, start recording already because it will get busy. Joe uh, of a local uh, small airport, which uh, I'm mean, the only one that is, has coverage, which makes me feel good. All right. Joe, on the third uh, of the next month, I will have uh, been uh, sharing for 10 years. It's gone quick. Oh, yeah. Nice, nice. So, Joe, are you um, sharing information uh, to Flight Radar? So, they get your information to put them the information on the website or something like I said I'm a complete noob in that so let's uh, slow down guys Did you see, George and Bully, are you a rugby uh, league a supporter? Are you uh, an NSW Blue supporter? So, did you see this? Bram, uh, the, that's neat. Usually I pick up uh, from the UK all the way uh, to Germany. Only been in sharing about two years now. All right. Joe 
What was uh, that uh, look for? What look? <laughs> oh, okay, but well, let me concentrate now. <laughs> okay, localizer on. We have already a look right localizer catched captured. So let's go to the approach. There we go. Plus one. There we go. Yosef compact landing with a uh, runway. Yes, a runway. What was it? Twenty six. Landing gear down. Come on. Flaps too. Joe, uh, the planes uh, you see on Flight Radar 24 are tracked by lots of different stations around the world. Radar satellites and uh, users like us. Oh, nice. I didn't know that actually. So, I learned to something today. Okay, Flaps 3. There we go guys, we are at the end of our last uh, stream of uh, this week. So welcome in Oman. The Muscat uh, Airport. We are landing at uh, runway 26. Today. So we have a headwind. A headwind of uh, 12 knots. 11 <coughs> and uh, we'll be doing a full ILS landing that will be nice it's a long time ago so 144 2000 speed indicate to 140 that's good Flaps full. And then we are uh, almost ready for impact. Nice plane. Let's see how the landing will go. <coughs> so very slow approach. And then on the left side we see the city. On the right side we see water. Elliot, uh, long flight, yeah, one hour and uh, 45 minutes so far. Normally it was planned for one hour and 42 minutes, but we slow it down. And I get stutters, that's not a good thing. Yes, sir, I see you approaching. Oh, nice, nice, nice. I see you on the ground by right, your name. Alright, ready for some action. Auto throttle off. Autopilot off. Manual control, my plane. I need power. Okay, there we go, guys. 500. There's also a Payware Airport. 300. 100 above. 200. So, ready for impact, guys? Minimum. 
100. Fifty, forty, thirty, twenty. Retard, retard, retard. Ten, five. No way. Not good, not good, not good. I need to make some space for Glad Knight for his landing. So I'll make a. Okay, we are uh, off the runway, so the runway is clear. We stop here and then we go to the re uh, not to the replay but uh, to the landing of Ignite at night and I need to speed up my camera why I never do that in the beginning of the stream all right so here we see a Betsy or and Dexter all right so he's flying the a380 again like it shows but uh, it's actually the a310 Joe, you vacated the uh, runway quickly. Yeah, I need to do it because uh, you are coming, but you are still at uh, yeah, 35,000 feet or what? Or 3,000, what is that? <laughs> Jet 77, uh, what was that? And grab uh, some vitamins, mate. <laughs> yeah. Next time, that night, uh, how did I uh, miss you landing? It's not landed yet. I am landed, but uh, not, uh, not at night. So this is the uh, airport, Payware Airport uh, here in Oman. Looks good. There we have a. Uh, uh, first we have Joe. Okay, first we have Joe. <laughs> Dexter. Oh, he hasn't. <laughs> yeah. Some I don't I don't like those textures here on the ground. Here also not. The airport itself looks uh, great. There's not uh, 20 nautical miles away. And there we see a uh, Joe coming in. And his uh, livery is correct. That's the exact uh, same uh, livery that he is using. Oh, nice. Nice landing. I think he is improving a lot. Mr. Joe. Nice done, mate. So this is the livery that he uh, used. So guys, uh, once again, uh, for the pilots that fly with me, if you want to uh, show up with the exact, correct um, livery that you use into my stream, then I need to have those uh, liveries in my community folder, because I did that with the one from Joe. So that's in my community folder, and uh, they are now empty, actually, because I deleted everything. So if you want to show up, uh, properly in my stream then uh, send me your um, deliveries that you use for the plane and then I'll put it in my community folder and then uh, you show up uh, properly here you see there's uh, me coming right behind uh, the Concord uh, <laughs> the Concord that's a plane that I don't fly. I don't have it. Joe, uh, I think uh, I land better with uh, passengers. Yeah. Well, I was flying today without passengers and I screwed it up. So this is a bit uh, a bummer of uh, that you get this with the airport. 
So it looks uh, nice from far, but far from nice. As you can see. But once we come here, it's an all different story. So this uh, looks quite nice. But it's not modeled uh, inside here. But uh, it looks nice like this. So let's uh, see where uh, Glided Knight is. 3000 feet or something. If I can uh, read that correctly. So I don't know the local temperature here, but I think it uh, is uh, much warmer than at my place. In the meantime, uh, Dexter is uh, going to the gate. He will park right there. <laughs> Joe, <laughs> almost a gesundheit, yeah, in, uh, in English. <laughs> I just could, could uh, hold it. <laughs> so I hope I can sleep good and that uh, we feel uh, much better tomorrow because otherwise it will be a long weekend. <laughs> So 1,700 uh, feet for Knight at night. And we wait for his landing, then we do the replay of uh, my landing as well. I will not uh, taxi to the gates, so we do that after. And then uh, we will see my uh, bad landing to finish the week or this week. So tomorrow no stream, Sunday also uh, no stream, but uh, Monday we are normally back to fly from uh, Germany, from Frankfurt to La Palma de Mallorca. So that's the flight for Monday. We do that with the headwind A330, 900 Neo. So that will be a yeah, nice flight. We also need to go to uh, Marseille, I believe. The airport that was missing last week or this week when it was. So, and also the flight request of uh, Sean, we need to do, redo. Oh, there is Sean. Look uh, like I'm early. <laughs> uh, you're a little late. <laughs> Sean, welcome to the stream, mate. And uh, yeah, we are waiting for the landing of uh, Glided Knight. He's at uh, 1100 feet, so is a landing very shortly. Uh, I landed already. Also, Drexler landed. He's already parked on the gate. Cho uh, is taxiing. Uh, is actually in front of my nose. He's facing myself. There he is. So I had a very bad landing. So. So Sean, hope you are doing fine mate, and uh, thanks for uh, jumping in. Noah, hey, you remember me? Yes, uh, I think you ask me that every time, if I remember you. Sean, how was uh, the McGrain Airport? Um, to be honest, not that great. But I also needed to change my flight because I... I made actually a flight of 19 minutes, so I needed to change my uh, destination airport. Um, found that out uh, this afternoon. 
toilet was a bit stupid and uh, yeah so now we are in Muscat in Oman so we, fly, we flew to here to one hour and uh, 45 minutes that we were flying so and a bad landing Michonne, uh, yeah, Joe, uh, transferring, uh, transferring uh, your passengers. Okay, thank you very much. So, then uh, at least I can uh, deliver some passengers. Sean, uh, doing all right, mate. Recovering uh, from a COVID. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. So, <coughs> I hope you uh, recover very well and very soon. Hey Sean, I hope you uh, guys are good. Well, yeah, I was good. Today I'm uh, pretty sick. So, and it's a uh, very bad timing. Of course, it's always a bad timing, but I'm the whole week I uh, don't need to work, and then the weekend I need to work, and just before the weekend I get like this. That's uh, a. <sighs> So here we have a glide at a night. Let's see his landing. Joey's landing was nice. We didn't see the landing of a uh, Derekster. Um, but we will see now the one from a uh, Joe. But well, from glide at night, sorry. So you see the speed difference. Uh, the one from Joe was uh, much faster than this. And uh, we have uh, Joe in the background. Alright, a bit uh, to the right, the same as me. But uh, I think I hit my wing uh, to the runway. So we will see that uh, very shortly in the replay. So, that's what we're gonna do. Sean, uh, sorry about that mate, uh, you sound uh, a bit sick too, yeah. I slept before that the stream started, when I we, we came back from the restaurant with my son. I uh, came home, immediately went to my bed and slept until um, 8.15 something. Then I needed to wake up to prepare the stream and uh, that's what I did. In the hope that I will feel a bit better. My head is already much better because I had a lot of pain on my left side. Um, so that's uh, already uh, a bit better. I took also some medication, and uh, yeah, hopefully it will be a bit better tomorrow. <laughs> so we go to the uh, replay. Stop. Uh oh. Okay, there we go. No, uh, see, I got to sleep. Uh, have a good night. No, I say Paul, have a wonderful weekend and see you in next time. Joe must be a strong crosswind. Sean, uh, so you went to the airport uh, this morning when you were sick? Uh, yeah, that was a bit of a mistake, I, mean, I think. Uh, to go to the airport because I was already sick and it made it just uh, a bit worse or maybe it didn't make any difference it would, it would get worse anyway I don't know but uh, yeah so like uh, in the airport I was sneezing you know and then when, when I came home I got really sick and then uh, but I still needed to prepare the stream for this evening and then I saw that uh, yeah, the flight was only 19 minutes, so I say I need to change that. And then, uh, yeah, lots of work. I also need to prepare the streets for next week. But then after that, we went to the restaurant and I came back home. Uh, I was able for to sleep for an hour, a little bit more than an hour. So, that's why it's already some help. 
So here we have my uh, landing. All right. Whoa, what was that? So that was not a, a great uh, landing, of course. We will see that uh, from the other side. Muscat Approach Gulf Air Golf Foxtrot Alpha 19050 is tight Airbus A20 and 3 miles east of Seab 400. Yeah. Request clearance to transition Charlie airspace. But uh, it was, uh, for the rest, it was a wonderful flight. This plane uh, flies wonderful. <laughs> Sean, drunk landing. <laughs> Yeah. They say always Air never Golf fly Alpha and drink. Or never drink when you fly. So that's why I always drink before I fly. But then, yeah, it don't help. Jotri Wally, you are not a uh, play Horizon uh, and no. Uh, due to lack of the time, um, yeah, I'm not uh, playing now. Did we hit with the engine? Do we have engine damage? Let me see. Next one, hold. Sean, is that uh, a gold course uh, near the runway? I don't know, I don't know. Next sir. Uh, wait, I will uh, first see the engine if it touch. If it touch. I cannot go low enough. We don't think that we just touch. No, just not, I believe. So. Okay, so uh, one more time then from the inside. Muscat Approach Gulf Air Golf Foxtrot Alpha 19050 is tight Airbus A20 and 3 miles east of Seab 500 feet. Which one? Request this one? To All right. Transition Charlie Airspace. Gulf Air Golf Foxtrot Alpha 19050 Muscat Approach. Squawk 7 Next, uh, get it all down the hatch. On the stream, and no one can uh, smell my brand. <laughs> Indeed. Joe, you mean the landing? Oh yeah. <laughs> I'm not playing at Horizon. We are we are doing the flight simulator. Yeah. All right. I got you. Sean Golf. Is that a golf course near the runway? Oh, uh, I will check out after me. Dexter, uh, how come it was a production you were so on track of the runway? Yes, everything went perfect until I took control. And there we see Joe. <laughs> Alright. And then drifted, yeah, yes. Nice the door is verified. Next, I was centered uh, very well, but I landed too hard. All right. <laughs> so, um, Michonne was asking uh, for a golf course. So let's uh, see where he saw that golf course. Oh, this is this the golf course he means? This is the only place where there is grass here, so it must be a golf course. Yeah, definitely. But it's actually very uh, expensive here because if you all throw all the balls into the water, then you need to pay some divers to get them or buy new balls. So. No, I, I guess it's a golf course because that's the only place that is uh, that looks green. So it must be. Next, uh, this uh, the airport is a uh, really nice top thumbs up. Yeah, the the airport itself uh, looks great. Only the textures next to it. My my plane is off. Who turned my plane off? 
Really? Someone turned my plane off. Okay, I cannot taxi anywhere. Even the, the set cones here. Why my plane is off? Who did that? Next amazing landscape here. Lobed mountain range. Yeah, it is. <laughs> and next, uh, there was an, uh, an optional download for higher resolution uh, ground uh, textures. Did you download those too? Uh, no, I don't think so. I don't think so. I need to check it out. I get. I don't think so because uh, look those uh, textures. I'm not happy with that, you know. For me, this is not acceptable. But if there is, uh, I didn't see that option. But if there are a higher uh, resolution, then uh, okay, then it's okay. I need to check that out. Sean, all right, guys, uh, gotta go. Uh, hope you feel better there. Uh, thank you very much, uh, Sean. Uh, I hope too. I hope uh, you uh, recover very uh, well and very soon from uh, COVID as well. So, uh, yeah, and thank you for joining. Have a wonderful weekend, Sean. And I uh, hope to see you uh, next week. So next week we have also nice slides coming up. We apply, we start off with the uh, Headwind 830 uh, from uh, Germany, Frankfurt to uh, Spain. And that is uh, to Palma de Mallorca. Joe, uh, maybe too much uh, landing damage. So it shut and down your uh, plane. Oh, did we add landing damage? It landed only four times. Good night. I have a nice uh, weekend uh, to Sean Delaney. And then uh, Sean, have a nice weekend uh, from um, Dexter. And Sean, cheers, guys. Uh, good weekend. Thank you very much, mate. So, Sean, very nice weekend for you. See ya. So, guys, uh, this was uh, the stream uh, for tonight. This was the last stream of this week. And uh, next week, we are back from uh, Germany to Spain. So, I'm looking already forward uh, to it. So, hopefully, everything will be fine. So I want to thank the, the pilots that uh, flew today with me, like uh, Dirkster, thank you very much. Um, and also Joe, Rimboli, well, welcome, and uh, yeah, thank you very much for flying with me. And also Knight at Night, so thank you very much. J77, have a great weekend uh, till uh, next week. So also our VIP member, J77, thank you very much uh, for joining the stream. As always, and uh, yeah, have a wonderful weekend. Um, enjoy your family and uh, enjoy the whole weekend. So, guys, uh, yes, also, uh, once again, Derek, sir, thank you very much for what you did this morning. So, your donation it helps me really much. Uh, yeah, so thank you very much, Derek, sir. Um, the little was predictions to make sure you get enough rest. Have a good weekend. Enjoy. Uh, well, I try to rest. Uh, that's what I'm uh, going to do uh, right now. I will go to my bed and uh, try to rest uh, as long as I can. And then uh, hopefully I'll feel better tomorrow. Otherwise, it will be a long, long weekend. Because after that, I have only four hours time to sleep. Um, if I don't sleep good this night, the other night it will be, or day actually, because I sleep in the day then, I have only four hours to sleep then, so it uh, will be very hard. Then. Next time, no problem. Thank you very much, mate. Jutrim, well, thank you everyone uh, for the great company. Enjoy your weekend, everyone, and try to get uh, some rest saving. Thank you very much, I will I'll try to do that. So, as fast as I can. So I just put the a new stream online and uh, planning will be for Monday because uh, we change uh, all the time. So.
ready to make that planning on a Monday and then uh, yeah, we prepare for the new three week good night uh, get well soon mate and enjoy your weekend all time you too mate thank you very much and uh, thank you all for the support and the best uh, best wishes so thank you very much uh, hopefully I'm good on a Monday so guys this was a stream see you next week enjoy your weekend stay safe and uh, yeah stay healthy see you guys until um, next week bye bye